art to me is like a lifeline too. Um, I don't think how I could survive without art in my life one way or the other. I think this world is a little crazy and art kind of stabilizes it in my, in my life. originally from Amsterdam, the Netherlands. I arrived in Chattanooga in 87. That was actually when I first took a class with Alan White at, um, at the art department. Like around 2008, I decided to go back to school full time and get my art degree. I always loved art and I thought I might as well make it official. It opened up a whole new world for me, seeing at art with totally different eyes. When I did my senior thesis, I thought, well, I need to do something different and just not paint. So I decided I want to paint with yarn. I lost my son uh, in a car accident and when that happened, I mindlessly started knitting scarves just like so I didn't have to think of patterns. I also started painting more, painting him as a baby, as a toddler, as a grown up. Um, I think it helped me both to get through a really difficult time and I also like to share that with others. and. Um, so about four years ago, I proposed to start doing art programs at Juvenile Detention Center. Hopefully they relate to something I paint, or it makes them think about the relationship they have. I just hope that it gives them a good feeling and not an indifferent feeling. I think art always has been part of my life and I think when I create or when I make art, that's when I become timeless and sometimes I can paint till 3 o'clock in the morning and not feel that I'm tired. We have an incredible amount of artists in the city. The art department at UTC is one of the best kept secrets. I feel like I would love to tell everybody, go and take the classes or go and sign up at UTC. And probably not only in our department, but there are so many other uh, subject matters too that you can I think it's a great it's a great school.